Hi, this is Brian Kim, and I've been asked to share this video on the Epsilon E1-271 narrow wire speculum. Now, you've seen me post a few videos on this particular speculum. I believe the SIR-10 video shows this, and then also my last best way to do cataract surgery video, I think it was 231. I wanted to highlight a few things and why this narrow wire speculum is so much better than the standard Lieberman speculum. And it's particularly advantageous and so much better than the Lieberman speculum for the floppy eyelids, deep set eyes, and narrow palpebral fissure. Now right here I'm using a standard Lieberman speculum and you can see here this patient has floppy eyelid syndrome and you can see the opening of the lid is very restricted and that's because the Lieberman style speculum has a wider blade and because it's wider it doesn't allow more opening in the palpebral fissure. And so because of, again, the Lieberman speculum is wide, this patient has floppy eyelids, and you have this rectangular opening to the lid. And because of its rectangular configuration, there's limited access to the superior and inferior limbus, and that's the area that we work on when we put our paracentesis incision, and that's a very important real estate for us to be able to do cataract surgery. And so this is the E1-271 speculum, it is a narrow wire speculum compared to the Lieberman. You can see the narrow blade. It's much smaller. And because of it, look, when I retract the lids, look how much more opening I have on the superior and inferior cornea. I can see so much more of the conjunctiva. I have so much better access to the limbus. And you can see here, I call this a diamond opening speculum and it's because it has more of this diamond configuration where the apex of the diamonds are retracting the lid superiorly and inferiorly you have a lot better access for when you're doing the cataract surgery so again here you can see i'm going to go ahead and compare this again once more to the lieberman style speculum you can see how much narrow the opening is i don't have as much access to the superior and inferior limbus and this is important area for me to be able to access when i'm doing cataract surgery and it's much more limited in the lieberman style speculum in these types of eyes so again narrow palpebral fissure floppy eyelids deep set eyes look at the opening of this speculum because of the diamond shaped opening of the speculum meaning the apex of the diamond is retracting superior and inferior you have much more access for the surgery you have much more access to the conjunctiva and so again this is the epsilon e1-271 narrow blade speculum which i have called the diamond speculum and is really an advantageous speculum for the challenging orbital anatomy cases so i hope this was helpful to you and i thank you for your attention